Following planting in spring, it takes one to two weeks, if the weather is favorable, for the cotyledons of the young plants to develop. Already at this early stage, the root is well developed. In many soils, dark brown, thick-walled cysts lie hidden. Many of them have lain dormant here for years. These cysts often contain hundreds of eggs. Each egg contains an infectious juvenile of the nematode Heterodera shactii. Substance is released by the roots of the young sugar beet plants stimulate hatching of the juvenile nematodes. The nematodes break through their eggshells and then emerge from the cysts. As soon as an infectious juvenile has reached a sugar beet root, it uses its stylet to penetrate into one of the cells of the outer root layer. The roots of sugar beets are suitable hosts for this nematode species. Using the strength of its muscles, the nematode migrates through the root tissue. Supported by numerous cell wall digesting enzymes that are secreted through the nematode stylet, the juvenile advances from one cell to the next, though without feeding. 